Hello everyone, we are back. I was on my way here um, to Frankfurt um, and getting my connecting train ride from there. That's Frankfurt main station. I was so tired, I did not sleep at all that night. Um, and it was an objectively shitty day. <laughs> um, but yeah, I was happy. Um, I was happy getting back to university, heading back there, and also talking to my future landlord. Um, so yeah, that was the ride. city um yeah i had a class today and i um put in some essays um that went really well my professor liked what i did so i'm really really happy about it um other than that yeah i woke up bed or i did not sleep at all i um traveled um for four hours um yeah at five in the morning i attended my journey and i arrived at nine and at ten my class started and now i'm in the hotel i'm gonna get a two three four hour sleep and then I'm going to go into the library and study and work on my essay that I have to finish. Um, it's an essay about Susan Wolf. Um, so that's one of the things, like, one of you asked me if I could link the essays below. I'm going to do that. And Susan Wolf is one of them. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna read that, write an essay. And um, tomorrow morning, I'll have um, uh, get together, meet up with my, um, um, come on, who is it? My brain isn't working. Um, my landlord, there we go. Um, yeah, to set things up for February, where I'm gonna take over the lease. And also, I got a remote job, woo! And it couldn't be better, it's only four days a week. It's a well-paid job for four days a week and home office. And I'm so relieved that I'm gonna be able to study and be flexible and not, yeah, I don't know, attached to one location. That will help a lot. But I gotta get a, uh, I gotta nap. I gotta take a good nap. So tired. 
tired. Oh, this time, you know, the last time I think I showed you, um, they always have like a different theme, this room's here. And it couldn't be better because Miro is probably my favorite artist, uh, maybe next to René Magritte. And so it's all Miro. It's a sign. I mean, come on. <sighs> I'm in love. Also, you remember I told you um, the whole city here is basically the university. Like, wherever you go, there are faculties. Like, the most beautiful buildings are faculties that belong to the university. So, here, this one, like, I'm in a hotel, random hotel, and across the street, I see the faculty, the psychological faculty. I mean, I just love it. I just love the architecture. Come on. So here I was strolling through the city. I, oh my gosh, I adore this city so much. I'm gonna say it till I get tired and you get tired of hearing it. But yeah, it's such a, such a beautiful city. That's like the center kind of, yeah, center-ish. Um, yeah, look at all these beautiful houses. Uh, well, and I live there. I live in the middle of this beautiful town. Um, or oh, well, I will be living there. Um, Man, it's like, yeah, it's like Harry Potter uh, childhood dreams coming true. <laughs> um, yeah, and then I sat in this beautiful little cafe and did some work for university. And, yeah, finished reading some essays. So I'm currently reading um, this essay um, from Susan Wolf and it's about like modern day, how would it be to be like a modern day um, saint um, according to, yeah, moral laws and it's really, really, really um, interesting. I'm gonna talk about it in a future, a future video and here you see me enjoying my carrot cake um, well you know I'm human after all uh, then I went into the local stores and they tuned me so Christmassy and kind of cozy and homey I liked it a lot and after that I had it to the library to study again <laughs>
After seeing Marburg in miniature format and uh, getting something from the vending machine, something sweet, I saw these two lovebirds dancing. I thought it was so nice, like watching them practice um, at the library <laughs> was beautiful. So that's the next morning. I was leaving the hotel and um, yeah, they have like a community kitchen where I got some coffee. And I headed to my meeting with the landlord, which was way too early. But that's me. I'm always way, way, way too early when it comes to meetings. Um, so I had a little bit of time to wander through the city but it was raining so it wasn't as enjoyable but still everything being new it um it didn't bother me um yeah that's me embracing my hobo lifestyle not having a place to live yet um yeah, but I'm still like every time so amazed by like this beauty and the architecture and I have a warm coffee that I got from the soup kitchen, <laughs> from the community kitchen, um, from the hotel. Um, yeah, and then I finally, finally got to meet the landlord, but she did not tell me if she wants me as a tenant. So I had to wait another week or so till I actually got the beautiful news that she wants me as her tenant. Yeah, and now I'm officially renting a place come February in uh, the city where I'm also studying. Really happy about that.
like you know things happen in my life but they're not shareable and not interesting at all so um i'm not busy when it comes to vlogging and what to share on the vlogs but i'm busy in my private life so yeah please 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 bear bear with me but if you have any ideas what you want to see like regarding studies and um i don't know maybe also lifestyle or whatever let me know if you're interested in any any topics um i mean i'm gonna come up with some more creative um things uh but right now it's really really hard to do so um but yeah i'm gonna be vlogging still every every week for now i don't know if i'm gonna be able to continue when i'm i'm gonna have to write my class like my exams then i'm probably gonna take a longer break maybe like vlog every two weeks or so but for now it's still possible um yeah i hope you enjoyed it i hope you love my little university town as much as i do and um see each other next week thanks so much mm -hmm.